It's a three-row SUV with seating for up to eight people. Though despite its outward appearance, the luxurious cabin features a massive OLED display and leather galore. There's also a 6.2-liter V8 under the hood. And if this all sounds like a Cadillac Escalade, you're not wrong. But does an Escalade have optional electrified door handles? The Vengeance does. And if you prefer pseudo-military features in your posh SUV, there are many other option boxes to check. Of course armored body panels and bulletproof glass are on the list, but how about armor for the passengers? Vests and helmets are available, along with gas masks, magnetic deadbolts for the doors, run-flat tires, sirens, ultra-bright lights, a thermal night vision system, and we aren't joking about shooting pepper spray. It's also an option, and if you need to find cover for a quick escape, it even has a smokescreen feature. Those items and more are part of the optional military package, but if you just want to look tough, the standard issue Vengeance offers the same bulky video game body as the armored version. In fact, Resbani called on video game vehicle developer Milan Ivanov to design the Vengeance. Underneath it all is a Cadillac Escalade, and that means plenty of luxury comes standard. Resbani lists heated and ventilated seats, navigation with augmented reality, a heads-up display, a rear-view camera, a panoramic roof, and pretty much every driver assist system is included in the Vengeance's not insignificant $249,000 starting price. That also includes a choice between GM's 3-liter Duramax diesel making 277 horsepower or a 6.2-liter V8 good for 420 horsepower. Power goes to the ground through a 10-speed automatic. If the Caddy's naturally aspirated V8 isn't enough, the supercharged mill from the Escalade V is available. It makes 690 horsepower for the Vengeance, but it's an $85,000 upgrade per Resvani's Vengeance configurator. And as you can probably guess, Clicking all the wild options raises the cost significantly. With everything ticked, you'll pay approximately $600,000.